Brooks and Walker are thinking about that and they are cheating up. And instead, Devontae puts this one deep. That big leg takes it all the way into the end zone. And it's going to roll out the back. We're not even going to roll any time off the clock. And the Dinos are going to take a one to nothing lead. Catelier has Jamal Wiles in the backfield with him. Hand off. Lyles is going to try to take it around the left-hand side. Cuts up to the 30. About to the original line of scrimmage, the 35-yard line. It's going to be both out for this game. Dean Leonard getting the start at corner. Empty backfield under pressure. And down goes Catelier. Manitoba forced the punt. Matt Riley is going to boot this one away from about his 15-yard line. A bit of a wobbler. Dean Leonard settles under it at the 45-yard line, cuts to the hash marks and up, and he'll get to midfield before he's brought down. From Sinagra leading the offense up to the line. Jeshrin Antwi starting in the backfield, splitting off wide to the left-hand side is Justin Dasia. That is where Sinagra is looking. Hits Dasia up at the 50-yard line, and he can't elude two Manitoba defenders. He'll have Sinagra connecting at 73.5%. Second down and a manageable five. Sinagra with time as the pocket closes. He releases out of the backfield to Antwi. Antwi goes backwards, goes forwards to the sideline. Has the first down, cuts back inside, taken down. Out in motion to the left, first and 10 from the 32. Sinagra again steps up into the pocket, fires incomplete. Down 19 yards, six touchdowns for Klukas. Sinagra under a little bit of pressure, releases out of the backfield to Antwi. Antwi takes it over to the sideline, cuts it back inside the 20 yard line. And it's going to be another Dino's first down running. Well, Adams checks in as an interior lineman for Winnipeg. Hand off to Antwi. He tries the left hand side of the line. He'll get down to about the 15 yard line. That's taking on the University of Manitoba. Receivers in motion left. That's where Sinagra is looking as time again. Looks into the end zone. Has a man. Touchdown, Dino's. Angles on the replay. And I believe this was Hunter Carl with the sixth touchdown catch of the year. And Carl with a great pattern. Just able to get in behind the Manitoba defender, Shea Weeks. Again, I stand corrected. Hunter Carl, another explosive receiver. Exactly, Dave. But the beauty of this was that 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 Shea Ross is back deep. And DeFonte is going to drive this one a little bit shorter, taken at the 10-yard line. Good coverage at the by the Dinos, but cutting back and up to the 32-yard line is Jesse Walker. Looked like they had. Receivers collapse on the line, hand off to Lyles. He's gonna try the right side, turn the corner, string it out to the 40 yard line. He'll have about six yards. Shea Ross splits off on the short side of the field on the right. And there is the completion to Jesse Walker. And Walker gets Jesse Walker, Lyles in the backfield. There's the handoff, a little bit of a counter. It's a room again on the right hand side of the line. Moving the pile down to the 49 yard line. Is down the ball just short of the 50 yard line, about nine minutes to go in the first quarter. Tell you in the eye, Lyle stays in the block, picks up a blitz, and there is a completion at midfield. This up midfield. And straight ahead into the line. I think that's Dezar that they bring in on short yardage. He surges ahead for four yards well, at a first down. Well, two, young does Catelier. Play action for Catelier. Looks out of the flat, has a man complete down to the 40, the 35. And that is Macho Bokru, the wide fence, starting at halfback this week. Play action again. In trouble is Catelier, and down he goes as he dives ahead to the 32 yard line. Receivers in motion left. Straight drop, under pressure, fires over the middle as he gets hit. And that Brad Mikola setting this one up just over 40 yards. Jaden McCoy puts it down. And this one splits the uprights. Manitoba on the board with 6.40 to go. Nice golf. I know start with a double tight end set. There's the handoff to Antwi on the right-hand side of the line, trying to pick a lane. He's going to get up to about the 39-yard line. Balls out. Manitoba says they have it. Come on, baby. We're waiting for the official signal. And Manitoba have recovered. We'll see if we get a replay on this. Jeshua, they take over at the Dino 38-yard line, first and 10, with about six minutes to go. Handoff inside, trying to bounce it out to the outside and counter it. Absolutely nowhere to go, and that is. Catelier under pressure from both sides, gets it away as he's hit. That is complete. It's going to be a first down, down to the 20 yard line. First and 10 from the 20 yard line. 
Rolling right, looking down towards the end zone, has a man! Touchdown, Manitoba! Jesse Again. Walker able to get the foot down as he beat his man to the outside. Was caught looking in the backfield. Walker, ever explosive, was able to get a couple of steps on him on that corner route and a beautifully placed ball by uh, Des Cantillier right before the, uh, the sideline there in the end zone. Great throw and catch by the Bisons. Mikulov drives it down the field, taking a step into the end zone by Esquerdo. Out to the 10, up the numbers to the 20, looking for a seam, gets to the 25 yard line where he is swallowed up. So he lines up in the eye, now splits off to the right, comes out of the backfield, long bomb downfield, looking for Klukas, and Klukas, that ball held up. He tried to turn around and come back for it, came back to the ball, so no flag. Second down and 10, Sinagro with the snap, has time again, launches over the middle, and I'm not sure who this one was to. The closest guy was halfback, Jaden McCoy. Defonte drives it right, gets some good hang time at midfield, settling under it, eluding the first batch of tackles, but going down just over the midfield stripe ish. Defonte drives it right, gets some good hang time at midfield, settling under it, eluding the first batch of tackles, but going down just over the midfield stripe ish. Kyle Patchell, three receivers on that wide side of the field for Catelier. Handoff inside, driving ahead down to about the 51 yard line, Jamel Lyles. Lining up deep to get that good running start. Empty backfield now for Catelier. Catelier under pressure, lobs Whoa! one up, and we have got a flag. This is gonna be pass interference on the Dinos. Empty backfield again, all kinds of time. Looking over the middle, and this one is intercepted by the Dinos at the 28-yard line, and that looked like Michael Schmidt make it up for that uh, penalty on the last play. Back at their own 27-yard line on the near hash mark. Handoff to Bobby Stewart. Stewart tries to bounce it off the right-hand side of the line, and he, Danny, wide left. Michael Klukas wide right for the Dinos on second down. Sinagra in the pocket, completes, and that is Hunter Carl. He's out of... First down again. There's the handoff to Stewart, inside, straight up the middle, tripped up as he goes up. Get that mojo back. Sinagra, Stewart releases out of the backfield, down the far sideline, looking for Michael Klukas, just outside of his reach. Bisons go with the three-man front on a passing down, three receivers in motion to the left. That's where Sinagra's looking, has time again, back over the middle, and in traffic, I think that's Hunter Carl, able to pull it in down. A Sinagra stepping up into the pocket, Evades the rush, has a man over the middle, and that is complete at about first and 10 for the Dino. Zeros on the clock. Last play of the quarter. Handoff to Stewart. Stewart goes into the line. Not much of anything there. He'll have a yard, maybe a yard and a half. Now it's the Dinos, first and 10 at the 45 of Manitoba. Sinagra with time, looking for Klukas deep. Klukas wide open. Touchdown, Dinos. Again, Dave, just the flat. Another look at the touchdown, and just a straight horse race. Tellier 10 to eight, and now Michael Klukas with a touchdown catch to open the second quarter, making it 15 to 10, and that ball goes over the head of Jesse Walker into the end zone. He'll take a knee to make it 16 to 10. Sets up with Jamel Lyles in the backfield. They bring a slot back across the line to block. And Lyles is gonna move the pile up close to the 40 yard line, a gain of about five yards. A real weapon in all three phases. Catelier, as the pocket collapses, finds a man over the middle and that is complete down to the Dinos, 51 yard line. Manitoba down to the 51 yard line of the Dinos and there's the handoff and caught in the backfield is Jamel Lyles. He did have a sore quad, so these are Launches it over the middle, has a man complete down to the 30 yard line. Spin move by Jesse Walker. It's all for naught as it goes back on a holding. And that is Reed McMorris, left guard, guilty as charged. Second down, and it looks like about 25. Oh, the Dinos jump here. This is gonna be a free play for Dizar. Launches it over towards the near sideline, has a man complete on the Dinos, 47. Oh, and contacting the kicker. And this one is gonna give Manitoba a first down. 
No question. That I believe that was Brett Wade coming up the middle, ran right into Matt Riley. And Taylor Altilio, the special teams coordinator, will be having a word with him, no doubt. Catelier back in the game, hands off to the inside to Jamel Lyles. Second down and short. Play action, looking over the middle into the end zone, has a man just out of his reach. And again, they contact the kicker one more time. And that was Adam Lorenz, the veteran defensive back, as this one is missed right out of the end zone by the Dinos. But this one is going to be a first down, and this drive is going to continue for the Bisons. Two running into the kicking penalties. Let's look at that again. Again, Jamel Lyles in the backfield, first to 10 from the 16. Toss to Lyles. He looks at the right hand side, and the Dinos able to penetrate for a three yard loss. Under pressure, swings it out to Lyles, coming out of the backfield, makes one man miss. The second time he's going to be trying for 23 on the near hash mark. And he has missed it to the right, and it goes right through the end zone. Again, you wow. Can, I think there's no stake over. First to 10, 8.40 to go. And off on the inside, no, Sinagra rolls right. Now he's gonna tuck it away and run, strings it out to the sideline, cuts it up, out of bounds by the Manitoba bench in the 45 yards per carry when he does take off with the ball. Second down and a couple of chain links. There's a handoff to Robbie Stewart inside. He just drives straight ahead, spins the pile to the 50 for a dino first down. Again, Sinagra, straight drop, empty backfield over the middle, has a man complete. That is Michael Klukas down to the 41 yard line. Dino set up with that double tight end look. Hand off to Stewart. Check that Jeshwin Antwi and a flag comes in and Antwi turns it up. Has first down yardage inside the 30, but let's see what this flag is. So with the holding penalty, it's back to the 51 yard line. It's gonna be second down and 20. Sinagra with the empty backfield over the middle. Has a man complete. Brendan Thera Plamondon. He turns the corner at the 45, looking for that, uh, now the original. Second down, Sinagra over the middle again, has a man in Sedan, he just couldn't catch up to that ball. He had his man beat over the middle. Seems, seems, seemed able to juke and then get that inside position. 49 yard attempt for Defonte and he is gonna miss this one wide left, but it is gonna go over the head of Jamel Lyles for a single point. With six take over, first to 10 from the 42 yard line with six and a half minutes to go until the half. They trail 17 to 11. Under pressure and down goes Catelier after the sack. Three receivers in motion right. Catelier gets it away. A wobbler just before he gets hit. This one is out of bounds over the Manitoba sideline. And, and Esquerdo, Jacob Esquerdo, the son of JP Esquerdo, waiting for this punt. And Riley back in after he was shaken up. Doesn't really get good distance on it. Taken by Esquerdo at the 45 yard line, looking for somewhere to go. And he just runs into the big white and brown pile. Er, First to 10, Dinos at the 35 yard line, just over five minutes to go. Dinos with the 17 to 11 lead. Sinagra oh! with the pocket, looking deep downfield for Klukas, and this one is intercepted. Marcel Arunda Welch getting under it. He takes it back to the 45, close to the 50 yard line. Bisons take over, first and 10 from their 47 yard line. Catelier looks towards the sidelines and just misses his man. In Now collapsing into the left side of the line and breaks in over the middle. It has a man complete out of the backfield. Lyles outruns his man, but a shoestring tackle at the much bigger gain. Dino 45 yard line, first and 10 for the Bisons. And a little delay handoff to Lyles up the middle. He's got some room, breaks one tackle, gets down to the 35 yard line, should have another Manitoba first down. Again, it is gonna be second down and a couple of chain links. And Dizar drives the left hand side of the line and he's Lyles in the backfield, receivers in motion right, handoff inside, this time the Dinos able to get that penetration. I think that was Brett Wade who got through, and Lyles is still trying to move the pile, and the ball comes out, Manitoba able to recover, that looked like a rugby scrum down there. Again. Slot back cuts across the line, play action, looking at the near side, back over the middle, intercepted, Boston Rowe, and Rowe hands off the ball, a bit of a dangerous play there. The Dino's actually losing some yards on that. Michael Schmidt. There's the handoff to Robbie Stewart. And Stewart met right at the line. He's going to be pushed back for a loss of a yard. Stewart for no gain. Two interceptions now for Catelier. 
as the Dinos escape. Man wide open down the field oh. and just out of the outstretched hands of Hunter Carl. This one away from about his 15 yard line as he steps into it. Big hang time, drifting back for it, take it at the 30 yard line. That is Shea Ross trying to turn it upfield. He'll get to the 31 yard line. Going into this game, the Dinos with the fewest punts in the nation. They punted just 27 times before this one. Detelier wants some big yardage, puts up a 50 50 ball, and he gets a flag. And Michael Schmidt he is going to get tagged for contacting Stephen Ugba. First and 10, the Bisons thinking a score before the half at the 45 yard line. And he has a man wide open, and that ball hangs up complete down at the 12 yard line to Jesse Walker. First and 10 from the 13 yard line. Empty backfield, complete down by the five yard line. And we've had a inside receivers in motion right to left. Empty backfield for Dizar. Lobs it in the corner of the end zone. Wide open, knocked away by Adam Loran Shea. One for two is Brad Mikoloff as he comes in for a 12 yard chip shot. No mistake that time to make it 17 to 14. It's an aggro with Jeshurun Anthony in the backfield. Justin Daziuk, wide right, collapsing on the line. Delay handoff to Anthony. He's got some room to run. Takes it up to the 40, puts his head down. He'll have six. Second down and three, 26 seconds on the clock. Sinagra with a quick drop and the quick strike to Klukas and he steps out of bounds by the Dinos bench. And he got about a 20 yard field to give Nico DeFonte a shot at a field goal. Over the middle and that one is complete. That looks like Richard Sindani. And short side of the field is Michael Klukas. Sinagra looking over the middle, has a man complete. Trying to get to the sideline and tripped up is Brandon Thera. He gets to the 41 yard line. Dinos with a double tight end set. Sinagra with all kinds of time. Launching into the end zone. This one hangs up and it's knocked away by Manitoba. Let's call this a 49 yard attempt as Hunter Carl is ready to hold. And Jamel Lyles is back. So the Dinos are gonna have to think about coverage on this. The kick is in the air, it's up, and it is good. So Again, the just a great kick by DeFonte, Dave. That is his uh, longest of the year at 49 yards with zeros on the clock. So the Dinos take the lead into the uh, halftime, 20 to 14. Dean Leonard back deep waiting for this one. Line drive kick, Leonard's gonna take it right at the goal line, take it up between the hash marks and the numbers, cut it outside, he gets to about the 20, where the Dinos will start, first and 10. Again. And the Dinos try that again with Jeshurun Antwi, and he is gonna get to the line of scrimmage. For the Bisons. Dinos deferred to get that wind advantage. They start the ball with the ball in the second oh, half, and that one is deflected. It was just slightly behind the intended receiver to with this win. Bit of a high snap. Corrals it, kicks it over to the wide side, away from Ross, curls back. He takes it on the run, fumbles it, and a flag comes in, and Manitoba able to recover that ball on the Dino side of the field. A fortunate bounce, and I think they're going to get a no yards on top of this on that short. And it looks like Theo Dizar starting at quarterback here in the second half for Manitoba. He's going to go deep right away. Good coverage by the Dinos, and that... Steven Ugba wide right for Manitoba on second down and 10. Dizar with time, launches over the middle, has a man in traffic complete, down by the goal line. Let's see where they mark this one. Looks like it's gonna be at about the one yard line. They go vertical to Jesse Walker. Set up Manitoba first and goal at the one. Jamel Lyles up to the line and Dizar is just gonna keep it going to the line. We've got a flag coming in. Dizar under center. And he tries the right-hand side, and a flag comes in again. Touchdown, Manitoba. Kickoff is going to be taken by Esquerdo at the two-yard line. He goes straight up the hash marks, cutting to the wide side of the field. Up to the 20, has a bit of a seam. 25, try and turn the corner. He'll go out of bounds. Dinos now trail 21-20. Sinagra with Jeshurun Antwi in the backfield. Antwi releases. Quick strike. That is going to be about an eight-yard gain. Hunter Carl, two catches, 24 yards, and a touchdown in the first half. Hand off to Antwi inside, not much doing there. Joseph straight ahead, and we've got uh, flags in here, so let's see if this time Manitoba got caught lining up offside. Bison's been offside, allowed him to get that, uh, that inside position there because 
uh, the Dino offensive line uh, didn't get any push. Strange game for the Dinos. They've shown some big play explosiveness, but just haven't been able to get that consistency. And this time, Sinagra gets the ball batted back in his face. Jazzy up, lines up wide to the left-hand side. Sinagra sidesteps the rush. He's going to have to take off the run, and he's got room to midfield with the 45-40 push out of bounds. Uh, peel back blocks, Dave. They're there to protect the player, so the Dinos here undisciplined, holding, and an unnecessary roughness. Field second down and 35 as they push the ball all the way back to the 19-yard line. Dinos, four receivers to the wide side on the left. Sinagra takes off immediately to the left-hand side, heading for the sideline. He takes a shot out of bounds. This season. And just a bad shank as this one is going to go out of bounds. Doesn't even get to the Bison 40-yard line. 13 to go as the clock starts to move. These are hand off to Lyles, tries the right-hand side of the line, and he's going to move ahead to about the 32-yard line. These are with the empty backfield, fires over the middle, has a man wide open down at the goal line, incomplete. Jesse Walker just couldn't catch up with that ball again. And Brad Mikulov, two of three, as he drives this one straight ahead and through. So with the, Bobby Stewart is deep, stays in the block. Sinagra out of the backfield. That is complete to Klukas. So Danny lines up in the slot on the left-hand side, looking back to the far sideline, and that one's incomplete over by the Dino bench. Eisen's enjoying that four-point lead. Defonte punts it to the near side, gets away a decent punt, holds up at the 50-yard line, taken by one of the short backs, and this one could go. Number 21, the up back, Shea Weeks taking it. There's a flag down to the 50. This is going to be a no-yards play, again, on a short punt. The play whistled in. These are with the empty backfield as Lyle stays in to block. These are is going to scramble, puts his head down, jumps over a Dino defender, gets down to the 29-yard line. Give him six yards, second and four, just inside the 30-yard line, empty backfield again. These are looking towards the end zone and the corner, and that is incomplete. Good coverage by Dean Leonard on Shea Ross that time. If he makes this, Dave, the Dino should be very thankful that it's only a one-score one differential with the amount of time that this Manitoba offense has had the football. And Mikulov, three of four as he puts it through from 36 yards. And Robbie Stewart in the backfield. He will uh, play action. Sinagra rolling right, nowhere to go, and he is just going to lob this one up. Looked like Jeshrin Antwi out there. Sinagra with time over the middle, sails that one. Boots this one to the sideline. It's another short kick. That no one yard. bounces to Lyles. Lyles at the 50-yard line. Mark the ball at the 46, first and 10. These are play action. Rolls looks left under pressure. Fires, and that one is almost intercepted. It was intended for Jesse Walker. These are with the empty backfield and time over the middle, and that is incomplete. He just flat. So Mikulov from 54 yards, and he saw the Dino swap that personnel group to get to a speed group out there. It's a line drive, and it is gonna miss wide to the left, and is gonna take it out of the end zone. 10, 15 to the 20, cuts it back at the 25-yard line. Sinagua remains in. Hand off to Jeshwin Antwi. That was not a well-executed play. They brought about half a yard. Second down, 10 and change. Sinagra over the middle. This one is complete. And that looks like Hunter Carl. Right on the numbers of Hunter Carl. And Sinagra spinning off safety. Tyler Fong able to gain a couple of extra yards. Jeshwin Antwi into the right uh, side of the line. Pushes ahead for, uh, I think that's about three. Okay. Down to 3.15 here. Receivers in motion to the left. Sinagra oh. looks back to the right for Klukas at the sideline, complete, step easy, first down. Sinagra with the handoff to Antry, trying the left-hand side, cuts back a little bit of room. He is down inside the 40-yard line to the 37, first down, Dinos onto that gap. Sinagra back to pass, looking to the near sideline, in and out of the hands of Michael Klukas. The drive started back at their own 25-yard line. Antwi stays in the block, now releases Sinagra all kinds of time. Over to the far sideline, and that one almost intercepted, intended for Hunter Carl. And might almost want to try a fake here, Dave. What do you got to lose? I mean, 
Now with the ball down at the 37 and inside two minutes to go. High snap, Defonte pulls it in. Line drive kick, this one is gonna bounce at the five and rolls out what of bounds. I think he killed kick. it at the one yard line. Did. And they didn't, they stayed a little deep and they allowed it to hit the ground and get out of bounds. These are in the gun in his end zone. First and 10, hand off to Lyle straight ahead. He's gonna take it up to close to the 10 yard line. Just bold that pile. A big, big series for the Dinos here. Ideally, you'd like Manitoba to be pinned deep and then have to punt. From the other side, that is going to be a short completion. Two Lyles out of the backfield. It'll be good for a first down. As I say about that first down, if the Dinos could dig in here and stop them, that could actually help them because Manitoba, if they can flip the field for the fourth quarter, would have to punt deep. There's a completion out to the 25. Comes to another first down. The last play of the third quarter. These are with the empty backfield one more time. Has to step up. These is going to run. He's heading for the sideline, looking for the first down marker, and he gets there at. Handoff inside, that one goes absolutely nowhere as Jamel has been contained so far. Empty backfield for Dizar on second and 16. Dizar puts it up, has a man complete, short of the first down at the 41 yard line. Again, Nico DeFonte struggled. Had two bad punts early before that coffin corner. And Riley, an end over end punt, it's gonna bounce at the 30 into the hands of Esquerdo at the 25. He just goes north and south to the 30 yard line. For Antwi and Robbie Stewart, both in the backfield. Antwi splits off to the left, Sinagra, and off to Stewart. He cuts back inside. He'll get to about the 35 yard line, have three yards. Here where they go on this one. Sinagra drops it out of the backfield to Antwi. Antwi at the 40, makes a man miss, gets to the 45, 47 yard line. Hurtled back to the huddle, didn't want help from the trainer, so he had to go out. Handoff inside, Stewart bounces to the outside. Midfield, he's got room 50 to the 40 to the 30 Manitoba defender cuts him off at the 20 tries to tiptoe on the line out of bounds at the 15 and he needs for the touchdown signals for motion there's the handoff inside to Stewart Stewart surges ahead to about the seven yard line second and seven from the seven Sinagra with the empty backfield has it batted back into his face and it's intercepted by Manitoba that ball pinballing around into the hands of the defensive lineman Cole Adamson himself. Here's the replay. Again, bats it up into the air and then catches it himself. Just a super job there by Adamson and snuffs uh, uh, the first really solid drive the Dinos have had. As Manitoba takes over at the 21 yard line with the seven point lead. These are with the handoff. Lyles trying to turn the corner. He'll get to the 25 before he's run out of bounds. Whoa, vaulting over those advertising signs. These are signals the motion with the right foot. Looks to the right hand side. And that one goes off the back of the Dino defender. Incomplete. Side 9.50 to go. Play clock down to five as the snap comes back. Pressure by the Dinos. Don't run into the kicker this time. Dean Leonard steps up, takes it at midfield. And he gets a shot right away. I don't know where the no yards call was on that. Nine and a half minutes to go. They trail by seven after turning the ball over inside the 10. Sinagra back to pass. Flag comes in, complete over by the far sideline. They're looking that way again. And underneath this one is complete. Hunter Carl cuts back in. He's got room to run, puts his head down, gets inside the 35 yard line. Not, not being six foot plus. That's the disadvantage, I guess, you know, Dave? Play action, looking for Carl down by the five yard line. He stretches out. They're gonna mark him down at the one yard line. Again, but again, the Dinos, when the chips are down, going to their main weapons and those main weapons delivering. Joseph with the snap. He rolls to the left and he's gonna walk in What an incredible called play there of deception, Dave. The quarterback boot get a much needed uh, major score here, Dave, with the win. And they're not messing around. And Defonte, with that leg in the wind, has a chance to give the Dinos a lead here. Line drive, that one is gonna roll into the end zone. And hustling back to get it is Jesse Walker, and he is just gonna take a knee. So the Dinos do take that one point lead. These are leading the offense out one more time. Actually, no, they're back to Catelier. Catelier under pressure. He is going to get tackled. So second down, they're going to give him a gain of two yards. So does Catelier. 
back in front of no doubt some of his old St. Francis teammates. Has time now rolling right. Lofts the ball up into the air. This one is hanging up. And again, the wind blew that one up. That was a bad decision by the young quarterback. He, Manitoba with four up backs. Line drive kick by Riley as he makes the most of it. It's going to bounce at the 40. Roll to the inside of the square. He takes it at the 33-yard line. Cuts inside to the 40. Still on his feet. Now taken down. He'll get to about the 43. Again. And Klukas over the middle is wide open. But now looking deep with the wind. And that is a pass interference call. And Lucas in motion on the right-hand side of the line again, looking left to Sinagra, praying for Anthony out of the backfield, in and out of his hands, incomplete. Lucas on the right-hand side, Sinagra with all kinds of time, looking for Lucas downfield into double coverage, and Lucas battling with a couple of defenders, couldn't bring that in. Mar Jay Ross and Jaden McCoy back deep this time. Defonte, another bad snap. End over end kick. This one's going to go into the end zone. Shea Ross takes it about five yards deep. Wants to bring it out and does. Gets to about the three yard line before he is taken down. So to 10 from the 20 yard line. Petelier steps up and skips that ball short. It was intended for Macho Bokru. Again, though, you got a chance to win the game. Catelier rolls right, he's under pressure, and down goes Catelier. I think that was uh, Micah Tights coming off the edge. Again, we can give the Dinos a three point lead. That is exactly what he is going to do. Hoping that he'd make a big, uh, you know, a big, a big return, you know? Dinos with the option, take it on their 35, and there is Robbie Stewart, bounce it off, gets out to the 45 yard line. Short yardage unit with Josiah Joseph checks in. Last time Joseph touched the ball, he scored. This time he surges ahead, gains three, four yards for first down. The play clock is at 10. Sinagra taking his time as he signals motion on the receivers. And off again to Stewart, and Stewart just surges ahead to midfield for a gain of about six. And there is that quick hitter. Hunter Carl fights off a man, 45-40, cuts it back into the 30, and he is down at the 27. First down, Dinos. Able to gain about another 10 or 15 yards after the catch. First and 10 from the 27-yard line. Under pressure, Sinegra, he escapes one tackle. Still under pursuit, trying to signal his players downfield. Now he just throws the ball. That is, Carl says he was inbounds, and they are going to give him the catch. Looks like they're going to give him the catch. Nope, no, they're uh, no catch. Now the officials talked it over, and they say Carl is out of bounds. 2:13, five seconds on the play clock. Sinagra takes the snap on second and ten. Watches over the middle, complete to Sindani. Sindani down to the 15-yard line. First down, Dino. Again, Sinagra signals for the motion. Play action, Sinagra rolling right, signaling his receivers downfield into the end zone and out of bounds. No one wide open, so Sinagra down and 10 for the Dinos from the 15-yard line. Sinagra rolling right again as Manitoba pushing. Sinagra under a lot of pressure at the 30, throws it. That one is almost intercepted in and out of the hands of Braden Watson. Defonte from 22 yards. And that one is right through. So it's a six point game. Manitoba will take over with time. Fonte with that cover team bunched up. Now they spread out. Line drive. This one is going to go into the end zone. Taken by Jesse Walker. And he fumbles the ball. And let's see where they spot this. It looked like he maybe got it to the goal line. The official is standing in the end zone. The 35 yard line kicks the right foot to get the receivers in motion. These are. Over the middle, that one is complete to the 47 yard line. Matoba first and 10 from their 48 yard line. These are straight drop under pressure. He's hit the ball, is loose. And I think the Dinos recovered. It looked like maybe Corey Robinson got down on that football. And again, just a great blitz by Adam Lorenz, timing it perfectly on the short side of the field to the right. Theo Dizar doesn't even see him. And Again, you can see that they try and make a short corner for Lorenz. Dizar doesn't even blown. see him. Doesn't. That was certainly a, a big one for them there with 106 to go. Handoff to Jeshur and Antwi. He cuts back into the line, takes it down to the 30, 32. A late flag climbs in. Teams seem to find a way to pull these games out, right? And there's the handoff to Antwi. 
on first down and 20, and Anthony gets it back to about the 40-yard line. Elena with a 48-45 lead. Sinagra back to pass, has time, looking for Michael Klukas downfield, incomplete. So Seven-point lead for the Dinos. It would have been about a 49-yard field goal attempt. You don't want to chance that. Line drive kick. This one is going to I think go he got out it out of at the one. I think he got it out at the one, Dave. That is That's the advantage of winning the toss and, 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 and deferring, Dave. These are with the drop in the end zone. And that one, you can tell the wind just killed it. Dino players are signaling safety. With the ball in the end zone and the foul in the end zone, by rule, we have safety. Okay, there was a there was a foul All in the end zone. zone. Another day, and that would double punch. The third time he had the opportunity to punt. The only series the Dinos moved the ball in, which right now is your margin of victory. Well, Davey, my my MVP of the game is the coin and the coin toss. I yeah. mean, winning the coin toss.